You can never go into an expo expecting to be 100%. It just doesn't happen. Bugs, glitches, crashes, it's all along for the ride. A lot of the problems that we encountered uh, weren't really expected. Uh, we had a lot of problems connecting to the internet, making sure that the multiplayer was working. We couldn't quite get it right, but we at least got it up and running to where people could actually join in on the game and get the experience that we wanted them to overall. But when the game is working, it is worth every ounce of carbonated liquid lightning we consume to make the game happen. Call Center Simulator is a multiplayer VR game uh, based on my personal experiences working for GoDaddy.com, and if we would play, uh, or we would have Nerf gun fights while we were on calls. And initially, I made a prototype about that. Uh, the game was really compelling; people liked it with the prototype, and so Monster Ball came in, and we started developing a proper game. Um, it turned into some mix of a massively multiplayer online experience and a really tight VR shooter, but without violence and a good dose of office humor. What we're planning for the future for this game is to actually incorporate massive multiplayer on a grand scale. We are actually the very first company to actually achieve massive multiplayer VR interaction at a massive level. I, bringing people together regardless of headset, regardless of play style, adding in the matchmaking, all that stuff, whether it be TDM style gameplay, capture the flag, king of the hill, anything. Uh, we will have that in and ready for you guys come early January. That way you guys can play and just enjoy the game to an even bigger level.